Today I'm going to be showing you how to install VMware Workstation Player. This is absolutely free and this will be useful for any of you guys wanting to learn Linux and up virtual machines. So we'll jump right in. I'm going to open up uh, Internet Explorer, Google Chrome, Mozilla Firefox, whichever you use. Whatever browser you like. I prefer Google Chrome. So I'm going to open Google Chrome up. And you're going to do a Google search for VMware Workstation Player. And VMware top is the top of the list pops right up. I noticed today though when I logged in and tried to download it from here there was an error on their server side. But I did find an alternative. Just a few lines below you'll see TechSpot VMware Player Download Free 17.5.2. If you'll click this link. And then you'll see download now and you have Windows, Linux, V12R, VM player so we're going to do download now for Windows because I'm on a Windows system if you're on Linux already you would do the Linux drop down here go click Windows okay. and then this is saying it's certified to clean more about VMware player should begin automatically if you'll notice up here in the corner uh, VM player starting to download you can see I've already downloaded it once but I deleted the back off just to make sure this is going to work for you guys before I done the video so once this is done, click on here for it to run. Okay. Alright, then you're going to hit, yes, you want to allow this app to make changes to your device. And then it'll pop up in just a second when it's ready to run. Here we go. So you're just going to click next. You accept the terms, the license agreement. If you want to read through this, you're more than welcome. I'm just going to go ahead and go through. And I don't need the enhanced keyboard. And I want to add the VMware Workstation Console tools into the system path. Next. I'm not going to do product updates on start startup because I'm running this in a virtual machine just for this video. I already have VMware on my uh, official like, hardware computer. And I don't want to join the VMware Customer Experience Improvement Program. So we're going to do next. And I don't need it in the start menu programs part. I just want a desktop icon. Then next on this. And then install. Okay, while this is installed, if you'll notice here on the desktop now, I have the VMware workstation. Let this finish, we'll open that up. Okay, we're going to do finish. And once you finish, you want to double click the icon to open it up. And you have the option to enter a license key if you want to do commercial use if you paid for the commercial license. We didn't, though, we're going to use this for. Works workstation 17 player for free for non-commercial use. So hit continue, finish. And it's going to open up. This is where you want to set up your virtual machines if you want to follow along. If you see any tutorials online, YouTube, or anything that you want to follow, you can come here and do create a new virtual machine. And then you're going to pick where you have your ISO file stored on this installer disk image. I have another video on this. It shows you how to install Kali Linux with VMware. I will link that below for you guys if you want to follow that link to learn how to install Kali Linux to your virtual machine so you can run it but guys yeah, that's all I have for this video just check back for any new ones if you like this video be sure to like subscribe and comment thank you